This is a short video will show to you how to measure the main engine crankshaft deflection. In a bigger engine, the piston is connected to the piston rod and the crosshead. The connecting rod is connected to the crankshaft so that the piston can travel longer. It depends on the specification of an engine. The piston rod consists of the stopping box a device that prevents the leakage along the moving parts uh, such as oil and scavenging air from the scavenging space this is also a good opportunity to our cadets and oilers to show to them how to measure the crankshaft deflection Crankshaft deflection reading should be taken while the ship is afloat. Place the dial gauge actually in the crank through opposite the crank pin. The correct mounting position is marked with punch mark on the crank through. Closing of the crank through compression of the gauge is regarded as negative and opening as positive. Set the dial gauge to zero at the B1 side near bottom dead center while turning clockwise that the reading when the true passes the positions B near bottom C comes upside T top E X outside B2 near bottom dead center Reading should be recorded. So guys, this is only for one cylinder. So after we measured all the cylinder, we are going to, to check the start bolt and nuts, the tightness, and also the temperature of the tankers.
so guys thank you for watching don't forget to subscribe like and share uh, god bless everybody bye bye